Hi guys, it's Ivo here. Welcome to this tutorial and I'm going to talk about stem. Stems are the thin vertical lines that are connected to the note head. So in this video, we are going to learn how to draw the stem and when are we supposed to draw the stems pointing upwards and when are they supposed to be pointing downwards. So we know that when a note has a stem, the stem can either go up or down. So how do we know whether should we draw the stem upwards or downwards? Rule number one. If the note is below the middle line, the stem will go up like this. Roll number two. If the note is above the middle line, the stem will go down like this. Roll number three. Notes on the middle line may have their stem down or up. It's very simple. This rule applies for all notes, bass clef or treble clef. But always remember, when the stem goes up, it has to be drawn at the right side of the note pad. And when it goes down, it must be drawn on the left side. This looks so weird. And remember, please, no lollipops. Anyway, here are a whole bunch of crutches without the stem. Let's put in their stems. So this first guy is on the second line. This is below the middle line. So we should draw a stem at the right side, going up. The next note is on fourth line. This is above the middle line. So we need to draw the stem going down from the left side. Next note is in the third space. We are still above the middle line here. So once again, the stem needs to go down. And finally, the last note is on the middle line. So we can choose the stem either go up or down. Well, there's no right or wrong answer, but because we have a series downward stems, so why not just stick with the same pattern and give this guy a stem going down? Got it? Cool! Let's try another example. So here we have a treble clef, and let's say we want to draw a minimum G, because it's treble clef. Do you still remember the landmark note in the treble clef? The line where the G clef curls? is the G line. Therefore, the G is right here. It's a minimum, so we need to draw an empty note head here. And now for the stem. Remember, any notes below the middle line will have the stem going up from the right side. And here we go. That's one minimum G. One last example in bass clef. We are looking for F note here. And remember, the other name for bass clef is called the F clef, right? So the F line is right in between the two dots. And boom, a crotchet F right here. This note is above the middle line. Is the stem going up or down? The answer is stem going down from the left. So that's all about it. If you did enjoy this video, please hit like. And if this is your first time on my channel, please subscribe. I make tutorial video based on basic music theory and piano playing. If you are into any of that, go ahead and check out my other videos. My name is Ero. See you next time.